morning and welcome to The Locker Room. Coach Jack here, and today's message is Strength Zone. We all know by now that to grow, we have to get outside our comfort zone. The other really important zone we have to focus on is our strength zone. It's a common mistake people make. We often get caught up in trying to work on our weaknesses so much that more of our product comes from our weaknesses than our strengths. I'm not saying we shouldn't aim to improve in areas where we aren't strong, but we'll do a lot better when we spend most of our time doing what we're good at and getting even better there. And here's an example. Please don't judge me. So I was up early recently and happened to be in the very rare situation of having the whole house to myself. So I decided to make myself breakfast. Now, just to be clear, I have on many occasions made breakfast without causing injury to myself or burning my house down. But you wouldn't know it with how this particular breakfast turned out. It didn't take any longer than me heating up the pan and getting distracted by a phone call that instead of a little oil in the pan, I poured a little vinegar. Totally grabbed the wrong bottle. Then I poured in the eggs. And it went as horribly wrong from there as you can imagine. It would seem I'm not quite as suave in the kitchen as I imagined myself to be. Just so everybody knows, my wife is amazing in the kitchen, so don't worry about my welfare or my kids. But what's the point? I'm outstanding at a few things. Not a lot of things, but a few things I'm damn good. Everything else, mediocre or worse, like cooking. I do try to get better there, and I'm not afraid to try, but if it came down to people coming to visit, I assure you my wife would be the one cooking dinner, not me. She's also a lot more handy around the house than I am. I stick to coaching and mentoring, mostly because I can't cause house fires doing that. And at work, I'm surrounded by amazing people that complement my skills. And we succeed far more because we handle different things well. So today, let's try to focus on our strengths and not get pulled off track into something where we aren't going to make a great impact. When we build relationships with people who complement us at work and in life, we get to make a bigger difference and live our very best life. Thanks for joining me in the locker room, guys. Make it an amazing day.